As one of the most well-known destinations in China, Gulangyu attracts a growing number of visitors from Southeast Asia. Malaysian tourist Tu Guihui is back for the third time. We Malaysian Chinese like coming here because most of our fathers and grandfathers were born in this place. There is special feeling here. The similar climate and customs make Mr. Tu and others like him feel very comfortable. One of the largest travel agencies in Xiamen says it received around 240,000 Southeast Asian tourists annually, and this year the number is expected to reach over 300,000. Over 200 charter planes flew between Fujian and Southeast Asian countries in 2014. This year, over 50 planes will be added. We also put more cruise ships into service for tourists from the countries and regions along the trade route. Aside from the growing tourism cooperation, closer cultural exchanges are in the making. Xiamen University, one of the leading universities in China, has built a campus in Malaysia. Li Xiaowen is busy preparing enrollment materials as a new branch will officially open its doors to the first 500 students from Malaysia and surrounding countries. We participated in many events in Malaysia, and a lot of local students were eager to know when the campus will be ready. There will be 14 courses initially, including Chinese language and traditional Chinese medicine. All of them will be taught in Chinese. A third of the overseas students in Xiamen University are from Southeast Asia, making it Chinese University hosting the most exchanges with these countries. Setting up a branch in Malaysia will actively promote the development of friendship, exchanges and cooperation among China and Southeast Asian countries. Experts say the new Silk Road is not about resurrecting the Asian road as it existed many centuries ago. Instead, it is about reconnecting the countries along the way to promote economic and cultural exchanges. People-to-people -people exchanges often seen as the foundation of relations among different countries and regions. With more cultural exchanges and tourism cooperation on the way, many believe the road ahead will be more reliable and sustainable. Wu CCTV, Xiamen, Fujian Province.